Good morning, invited uh, guests, the members of uh, Vision Development Foundation, the board representatives, the commissioner of mobile traffic, ably represented by the IGP here, the representative of uh, Farato Buffalo to Road Project, uh, Secretary General the representative of the beneficiaries of the uh, Bruce B Phase 2, the invited guests, and all the others that are invited to come and uh, attend today's presentation here. It is, of course, with a great pleasure on behalf of our able CEO, Mr. Momoru Trodabo, to welcome all of you to a very important presentation today in our office in Fajara here. As part of our norms at the Vision Development Foundation, our CEO, Mr. Momuru Trodabo, a Gambian, always find it very interesting and important to contribute to the social and the economic development of the country. And today, as we are about to witness the presentation of a vehicle to the mobile traffic unit of uh, Carnifi and some other you know support to other groups and uh, communities it is of course a gesture that has created a lot of identity on the face of Vision Development Foundation now Vision Development Foundation as we always say it is an organization or an institution that is established by Mr. Mumudu Trodabo with the objective of complementing the efforts of the government and complementing the efforts of individual people. Since the start of the COVID-19, Vision Development Foundation has done so many strive and they've contributed a lot to the social and economic development of the country and we've done so many other activities ranging from giving support to the needy, distribution of rice, oil, sugar, and some other things during the uh, month of Ramadan, and uh, giving out meat to the people in the feast, and some other things that we have done. But today, we have the pleasure to invite the beneficiaries, as we call them, to come and receive on behalf of their institutions the gesture that is coming from our able leader, Mr. Momodu Trodabo. Now, we all know that uh, the Gambia Police Force, they are not only partners to us, but they are broader institutions. And our CEO, Mr. Dabo, always find it very necessary and important to complement their good efforts because we know, you know, human, not only human resource, but material resources too, is very essential in their operation. So this is what has prompted to the presentation of this wonderful vehicle to the Gambia Police Force under the care of the Commissioner at Carnifing Division. On behalf of Mr. Momuru Truodabo, we'll applaud the good work the Gambia Police Force is doing and we'll assure them that we'll continue to complement their efforts in national development because it's not easy for them 
but we know when all hands are on deck, it will make life very, very easy for them. This vehicle that we will be presenting to the mobile police, we know in one way or the other, it will make their work very easy and it will create access to them. And it will also give them direct support, you know, to anywhere accident occur, they will be able to be there. And our ABLE CEO also has presented, you know, a coupon for six months fueling of the vehicle. And, uh, a full maintenance of the vehicle for six months period. That means anything that happened to the car, our ABLE CEO under the leadership and the Vision Development Foundation will maintenance the car for them at no cost and will take care of the fueling of the vehicle for these six months coming. So on that note, we will ask they themselves, you know, to take good care of the vehicle and to make sure that it is used for the intended purpose that it's meant for. So we thank Gambia Police Force and we're behind them and we'll continue to complement their effort and we'll continue to support them. On that note, we will now call on the beneficiaries one by one to give their remark on today's presentation. It's going to be $1,000 every week until the six month period elapses. That's what they have. We thank you. So we now invite the commissioner to come and say a few words on the presentation of the vehicle before we hand over the key. Thank you very much, uh, the Managing Director of uh, Vision Development Foundation. Uh, I first of all thank you through your CEO, who is no other person than Modu Trodabu. Briefly, I would just want to introduce myself, our relation, my relation, personal relation with Modu Trodabu. I knew Modu Trodabu far back in 1995 when I was a constable attached to Bundum Police Station. Most of his cases, Motro Dabo personally would love to assign to me because of my professionalism in the side of that job. Again, some months ago, two months ago, my men were represented here on my behalf and 60 bags of sugar were donated to this institution, Mobile Traffic, through this new Vision Development Foundation. And notwithstanding, all this gesture was based on our development, was based on our performance on the road. You hate it, you don't hate it, you know and you are seeing the performance of the Mobile Brigade in this country. Any small street or big street or anywhere you go into this country, you will find the mobile traffic doing professionalism during my tenure of office. This prompted the CEO Motro Dabo to give us this donation, which is a magnificent donation of this um, noble uh, uh, car. First of all, on behalf of my institution, the Inspector General of Police and his police management will take good use of this car. There is a saying in English, to whom much is given, much is expected. We will redouble our efforts for the development and advancement of this country. My advice would be, we are witnessing a lot of accidents and then people are pointing finger to the police, particularly to the mobile traffic. Again, we accept because, because we are the law enforcement agents. But again, I am also, I will use this ceremony to caution those drivers to say drive carefully. The life you may save may be your own or your family. Let's drive with discipline. I am so pleased and I'm so touched that we are going to use this vehicle in a civilized and a professional manner. I thank the New Development Foundation for peace, progress, and for continuous developing and helping the poor and needy people of this country, which you are known for. I thank you all. Good afternoon to you all, uh, Mr. Fofana, and through you to the CEO of Vision Development Foundation. Uh, my name is Omar Balde from Farato. I am representing the Farato Bafloto Development Association as the Secretary General. 
We are very pleased to be here to witness this presentation this afternoon. Uh, Farato Bafloto Development Association is embarked on a road reconstruction project which connects more than uh, 5,000 people living around the road. And we have a primary school living there, so many civil servants and so on and so forth. This road become very unaccessible during the rainy season and the community decided to come together to rehabilitate the road and then look for support from philanthropists like VDF and they have responded positively and this afternoon we are witnessing the presentation of a check amounting to 25,000 to help us to reconstruct that road. We are very pleased and I am much elated this afternoon to stand here and thank VDF for their support, which they are known for. VDF, for more than a decade, have been supporting a lot of needy people, communities and associations to realize their dream. And uh, this is one of the dreams that they are facilitating. We are very much pleased to say thank you, VDF, and Mr. Fofana, through you, to the CEO, we are saying a big thank you. We really appreciate this gesture. I know this is the first of the kind between us and VDF, but I am very much optimistic this is not the last. last. This is just the beginning of a relationship. And we are very much pleased, and the money you've given us will be put into good use, so that the children and the community that is living around that area would have a road that will be accessible during the rainy season. On behalf of the community of Farato and Buffalo, we said a very big thank you to VDF for the support you have rendered to us. Thank you very much. That's $25,000 for Farato. We now call on uh, Mr. Dukure to come and say a few words on behalf of the beneficiaries of the area there. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuhu ta'ala. I am Mr. Alhaji Banta M.I. Dukure, the religious chairperson of Bruce B. Phase 2. I am here together with my Alkali, who is Tijan Jai. I salute you all and I say good afternoon to all of you. Um, today, I am really very, very, very happy to be in your midst to receive eight bags of rice and an amount of $8,000 for the beneficiaries who are residing in Bruce B. Phase 2. You may wonder who are these uh, beneficiaries. These are people who are living with their families. And uh, if you visit them at their respective homes, you will find out that, well, the landlord of the various um, compounds have passed away leaving the wife around and the small kids. As we all know, feeding at this point in moment is a very difficult task bestowed on any responsible person. So we this, we've decided to come together to see what we can contribute at our community level to assist those unfortunate families that are living with us who are finding they are feeling very difficult. We decided that each and every one of us should contribute $300 minimum. $300 if it is extracted from your monthly income, definitely it will not even seek you financially. So, so many people pledge, made a pledge and just this morning, I was counting the amount of money that we have collected so far, and it amounted to $11,000. So we've extended the information to one 
uh, person who is working at the airport by the name of Amadou Fati. Then he promised us that he will make contacts on behalf of Bruce Lee. He made that contact through Toro Dabo um, company or organization. And uh, just at that point in time, we were called to come over to receive these eight bags of rice and uh, an amount of eight thousand dollars making our task very 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 easy for us to implement on we we only hope that this is going to be a continuous thing because definitely Toro Dabo is well known to our the Gambia and that we've realized the contributions that he makes you know for the development of the Gambian people so he's contributing immensely to the development of this country. Take into, taking into consideration all aspects. So we only pray that, we, we, we pray that, you know, the company will, 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 will go forth, you know, as they, as they wish. So we want to say a big thank you, definitely, to the company. And uh, we pray that, you know, when we receive these items, you know, it will be distributed fairly to the ben ben beneficiaries without any problem. On that note, I would like to say a big thank you to all of you, most especially those who are giving us these um, uh, gifts to, be, to, to, to take to the beneficiaries, beneficiaries at Rusby Phase 2. Thank you very much. That's eight bags of rice and eight thousand dollars going for eight beneficiaries. On behalf of our CEO, Mr. Mumundu Trodab, we call the Gambia Police Force, the Commissioner, to come and receive the car key and the coupons from us. Wish you all safe journey back. We thank you very much.